Unit 12, move up. Roger that. Dust is heavy on approach. Dispatch, this load is complete. Have the next truck ready for pickup at Alpha. Roger that. Moving now. Alpha Sierra, you are clear for approach lane 3. Watch the dust. Crusher feed looks good, consistent flow. Vibrations are steady. Next truck is approaching. The pressure is spiking slightly on the secondary jaw. Noted. Noted. Adjusting the feed rate now. See that bottleneck forming near the chute? I see it. Adjusting, Adjusting the speed now. Look at the rotation speed here. It's vibrating intensely. Agreed. I'm logging the fluctuation now. concentration levels are stabilizing perfectly. Excellent. The yield is looking very promising. Secure that clamp tight. It's locked in now. Clear for activation. We have a slight fluctuation on the current reading here. I see it. Adjusting the dial now. Alignment is stable. Confirmed. Initiating the next cut sequence. I'll just tighten the curve on this vector here. Good, that should resolve the overlap near the edge. How does this sapphire look with the gold? It complements the setting perfectly. Um, the color saturation is ideal.
Does this angle catch the light better? Oh, yes. Yeah. Yes, that looks perfect against the velvet. Velvet. Perfect fit, sir. It truly suits you. It feels incredible. The craftsmanship is superb. I agree. What about that. the rose gold perpetual next to it? Certainly, madam. Allow mm -hmm. me to present it. Mm -hmm. As you can see here, this hallmark guarantees the purity of the 24 karat gold. Mm -hmm. The craftsmanship. As you can see, all high value gold items are meticulously sorted by category. We use this. This technique secures the stone without damaging the facets. It requires a very steady hand. The clarity is excellent, but check the highlight on the center stone. I see it. Just a slight adjustment to the reflector should fix that. Hold the focus right there. Can we get a little more shine on the bezel? Looks great. That's the one. I adjusted the key light here. What do you think of the shadows? Much better. The texture really pops now. The embossed logo really catches the light here, highlighting the premium Have we feel. considered shifting the typography slightly left on the box? I agree. And let's test the darker gold foil. Gently polish the surface with a soft cloth. For detailed areas, use a soft bristle brush and a mild cleaning solution, then rinse thoroughly. Now that the case is open, you can see the intricate escapement. It's vital to keep this area free of dust, as even a speck can affect the timing. The purity levels are stable at 99999. Data correlates perfectly. The new cycle parameters are a success. The emissions data showed a brief spike in nitrogen oxides right here. I okay. see that. Water purity levels remain unaffected, though. The primary muster point is here on the chart. Remember the alternate route if this one is blocked. What about the night crew? Do they follow the same path? Yes, all shifts use the same evacuation plan. The topography is constructing well, but look at the density reading on the far wall. We need a closer look at that seam. Look at the resistivity data here, right along this fault line. Yeah, and the core sample matches the signature. This confirms the deposit. The crystal structure matches the deep strata profile. And the elemental analysis confirms high rare earth content. Check the flammability symbol on this one. Noted. The racks look secure up to level four. The pressure in line three is critical. I see it. Bypassing the valve sequence. Confirmed stable. The thermal readout on joint four is still fluctuating. The weld is secure, but let's run the dustic sweep. Looks stable. Powering up. 